Oh, y'all know what it is, man. Christopher Robinson got my Texans gear on, man. Houston, Texas, man. We found a way to win, get our second win. Second win. And uh, Tennessee, man, we won 19 to 14. And I tell you what, man, every time we play Tennessee, man, Derrick Henry gives us like 200, man. Um, but we actually played him well today, man. I want to say we held him to like... Last time I checked, it was like 112 yards. But I'm sure he gained maybe 30 more. So I would say if I had to guesstimate somewhere around 150. But we actually caused him to fumble. And we actually got something off the fumble, man. Whew, I tell you what, man. Um, early in the game, man, Davis Mills, I mean, not Davis Mills. Early in the game, Derrick Henry ran the ball. And I'm like, oh, no, here comes another one of them games. But... You know, you got Malik Willis back there for Tennessee, and he's not, you know, too experienced. And, you know, I'm thinking, you know, hey, man, maybe we could pull this off. But if you go back into the season, there were multiple games we could have pulled off that had horrible uh, quarterback play or horrible play calling, i.e. the Denver game. That was like the second or third game of the season. Anywho, we're talking about the Tennessee game, man. My defense, man. Shout out to my defense. My defense did what we could to maintain against Henry. And we really didn't have to worry about their receivers like that because Malik Willis ain't just flinging that ball around like that pause. I think last time we played Tennessee, his 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 thing was, hey, man, feed Henry. And we, we were actually able to do something about Henry, man. On the offensive side of the ball, man, we had Cook back. And, um, man. Ooh, thank God for Cook being out there, man. Um, Davis Mills fumbled into the end zone. Um, and that just made me think back uh, the Kansas City game last week where he fumbled in overtime and we ended up losing. But he fumbled into the end zone and Rex Burkhead recovered it. I'm like, oh, thank you. And then there were two times later on in the game where he fumbled the ball but fell on it in the snap. Man, as you know, in Tennessee, they were playing in 20 degree weather. So a lot of the field goals that you may take a chance and take 50, 60 yard field goals, that didn't take place today. But my special teams came to play. Um, my other receivers, like I say, man, Moore is all right with me, man. I wouldn't mind bringing him back next year and kind of giving him some more reps, man, at receiver. And Dorsey, I'm going to be honest, man. I think we have some decent receiver play outside of Nico Collins and outside of uh, um, Brandon Cook. Our offense is just designed to run first. But, I mean, with Pierce out, we kind of have to figure it out. And speaking of run first, man, let's 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 go ahead and put to rest that um, this two quarterback stuff, man. Um, I, I think, you know, it, it's kind of run its course, man. We played it three games. Um, I think uh, other teams are starting to figure us out with that. I think, man, you got two more games left in the season, man. Let Davis Mills go ahead and figure this thing out. So we have Jackson, and which Davis Mills was, he was on point today. So we have Jacksonville and we have the Colts. I want to beat the Colts. Um to, to keep our positioning in the draft, I don't mind if we lose to Jacksonville. I would like to win out, but of course, you don't want to go 4-13 and 13 and other teams have 4-13 and 13 and then jump in front of you and have the potential to pick Bryce Young from us. Even if a, even if a team that already has a quarterback jumps in front of us because we win out they can still take that pick and trade back for more picks so i don't even want to risk that so if jacksonville beat us they beat us but i want to beat the colts we got room to win one more game i want to beat the colts uh so jacksonville if y'all want to win the thing and go into the playoffs have at it but y'all know what it is man christopher robinson houston Texans. we finally got our second win i'm ecstatic Maybe that's the key to us, man. Maybe Saturday games or maybe it's just Christmas Eve. The Texas felt like giving us a gift. But anywho, y'all move to take it easy. Hey, Sean, all day.